This morning, another black eye for the Catholic Church in Miami. Last May, a popular priest admitted to having an affair. Now another priest is accused of having an affair with a former stripper fathering her child. This is Marilyn Epiphany Hernandez. Say hi. And this is Marilyn's father, David Dupin, a Roman Catholic priest. Marilyn's mother, Beatrice Hernandez, met Father Dupin seven years ago while she was on the job at a Miami strip club called Porky's. It was on a Sunday. I was on stage and he walked in. She says he spent $1,800 on her in the VIP room that night. Soon, they were living together. I was still married. In fact, he paid for my divorce. But their strange love story soon turned sour. Hernandez claimed Dupin urged her to exercise her demons with sex. He said, we're going to have to go to a place where they can take those evil, you know, spirits from you. I said, what do you mean? He said, a swinner's club. In 2005, the two separated. She sued the church and the archdiocese settled, reportedly for $100,000. Hernandez returned to stripping and Dupin returned to her. In April 2008, she became pregnant. First, he denied paternity. Then he demanded she give up the child for adoption. Then, Hernandez says, he turned violent. I thought, you know, he was going to really take my tongue out. He got very violent with me on that, trying, you know, choking me like that. Joining us now from Miami are Beatrice Hernandez and her attorney, Michael Filer. Good morning to you both. Good morning. Beatrice, let me ask you, when Father Dupin first came into your life, do you feel like he w was saving your life? It was something very special, very incredible what was going on in that you, moment. Right. The and way you, he was expressing himself to me, it was completely something completely different from where I was. Yeah. Different. You were in love with him. What do you mean I was in love with him? I had just met him in that moment. No, but as you, as the relationship continued, you clearly did that, at least initially, fell in love with him? Yes, I did. Yeah. So the relationship sours, you separate, you get an agreement from the Catholic Church, and then how surprised were you when he uh, reintroduced himself into your life. Say that again, I didn't understand that. He reintroduces himself into your life, uh, and you say father's, is, uh, father's your child. How, what is his attitude toward you, you now? No, he doesn't like that at all. He wants to hide the baby. He doesn't want nobody to know about this at all. Yeah. Let me ask. Let me ask your attorney, Mr. Filer. Do you feel like this priest poses a threat to, to Beatrice? Well, obviously, the allegations in the pending domestic violence petition are that he physically attacked her and became violent, and that my client is in fear for her life and safety. So I believe she has that fear, and we're going to let the court address that on Thursday. Right. And do, are we? Do we know for a certainty that this child is is his child? Well, I have seen the paternity results, and they will certainly be a matter of public record very shortly. I don't think there's going to be any question that Father Dupin is the father of Marilyn Hernandez. Wow. And what kind of response have you gotten from the church or from Father Dupin? Uh, none whatsoever. We're going to see them in court, and we'll see where things go from there. Beatrice, this uh, has had to be a, a pretty crazy ride for you. Thank you very much for taking the time to share your story with Thank us, you. and we will uh, have our eyes on the court when uh, this uh, comes into public view in the next uh, couple of days. Thanks so much. Thank you. All right. Thank you.